It's no accident that you are here today, as each of you were invited because you represent someone important in the individual and collective lives of Hannah and Jared. However, it was an accident that brings us here on this exact day. 10 years ago on this date, Jared started a journey that led him to meeting many of you. In fact, that's how he met Hannah. It's their wish to make this day a happy day, a fond memory. When we first met and this gorgeous young woman agreed to take care of me on Saturdays under the condition I take her out to brunch, that was pretty unbelievable. And we immediately had a connection I had never felt before. We felt like home. In under three months, I went from not knowing you to not knowing how I could live without you. Jared Michael Nieder, before we met, Before we met, my dreams were to travel the world. This is going to be a long... <laughs> there was a problem though. You had big plans to retire early and go travel the world. Little did I know that my true dream is building my life right here with you. I remember telling my mom I didn't want you to leave. The problem with great advice is it's usually not what you want to hear. She said I shouldn't ask you to stay. Actually, she said you would never forgive me if I asked you to stay. And then I'll never forget when I got the text. I thought I wanted to travel the world, but it turns out I left my world at home. That was unbelievable. To me, you represent so many things. My sense of comfort when I get uneasy, my sense of protection when I'm scared, and my sense of security, I know you'll always be there for me. You have already shown your tenacity to the world, and now, as one, we will conquer anything that life throws at us. up our lives and moved us to Lawrence for five months so we could be with my mom in her final days and grieve with my family after she passed. Hannah, you're just so unbelievable. I vow to be your fiercest protector, to be your best advocate, to make you smile every day, and to love you unconditionally. I announce with great joy that you are now husband and wife. You may seal this with a kiss. There was one other piece of advice my mom gave me that really resonated with me and has kind of been my mantra through this whole process. She said, Jared, don't F this up for her. <laughs> I think it's going good so far, and I vow to keep it going like that. What I wish for them on their wedding day is that their lifetime together as a team is one full of moments they wish would never end and continue to make each other achieve, laugh, and experience things they never thought they could.
We toast your mutual love and admiration. We raise our glasses as a symbol of we've got your back. May you get all of your wishes but one. May you always have something to strive for.